Kitty here with another episode of Okami. Alright. So I did a I did a bad <laughs> I did a bad thing. Um the whole rule of playing this was for me and Gardog to not look at each other's footage. And I helped Gardog edit his episode two and I ended up showing him all the episodes I've recorded so far. I'm really ahead of Gardog right now, and so you're probably gonna hear from him before you hear from me. Because here I am editing, like, I mean, recording right now, like, episode 14, I think. And Card Dog is, still has to record episode 3. So, you'll hear from him before you hear from me. I feel like I'm running a bit slow. Am I running some slow? Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm having a bit of a lag. I don't want that. What's going on here? Why are we lagging? Anyway, well, while we're looking at the footage, I saw a couple of things that I needed to do. Hopefully the lag will quit. Yeah, the stray beat was just sitting on top of the branch. I saw that. Okay. Um... I don't quite know what the lag was all about. I'm not, I'm not sure if it's going to continue. There's another flower over there. Got a bullhorn. Okay, any more flowers? If the lag continues, I might have to uh, get off for a moment and take a look, see what's going on. Uh oh, now my mouse isn't working. Yeah, um, not sure what's up with that. I should not be lagging right now. I'll be back in just a moment. Okay, I'm back. I think we might be good. I'm not entirely sure what was happening. Um, I think I had just started my laptop up, so maybe I didn't give it enough time to boot up everything. It was trying to tell me all these notifications, and I'm like, quit telling me things! I just want to play my game! Alright, anyways. Yeah, I saw the uh, flower, and I was like, ooh, I need to go get that flower. And I remembered that Kamiki Village also has a flower over by the waterfall, so I was going to go grab that. Plus, I need to get the the next fruit out of the tree for the uh, guardian sapling and Saka, uh, Taka Pass. Okay, so I was going to head back over there and do that real quick. But yeah, I'm sorry about the last two episodes. They, um, I was in all kinds of sorts. <laughs> I had stuff going on and there was one disappointment after another with the, um, with the game itself, like, trying to get things finished. And I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna play the game as it'll let me. I'm gonna try this. Since I'm on my way up there, I'm gonna try this again and see if I can get it. But, um, yeah, I was just trying too many things at once too early, and I was really embarrassed about the log thing. But when I went back and looked at the footage, it really wasn't that bad. I mean, even Garda, I was complaining about how the flowers were going by way too fast, but there wasn't as many as I was thinking. And then, of course, you know, I shouldn't, I should have stopped recording after, like, episode 11 that day because I was tired, and when I'm playing while I'm tired, it just doesn't come out that great. Bad things happen, my, my emotions go awry, and it just sucks. And I like to make content when I'm feeling really good and hyper and excited. But the content just comes out better that way, you know? I mean, granted, it's okay for you guys to see the other sides of me that I'm not too fond of, but... <sighs> anyway, it's not that bad. I just like it better when I'm happy and excited and I can actually talk to you guys and, you know, give y'all some good content that you guys deserve. Well, um, this, I'm gonna go ahead and call this a success. 
<laughs> look at look, little bear, sleepy bear. Got something for you. <laughs> Finally! Oh, you gotta be kidding me! He went back to sleep! And then I had a pop-up just come up. And I just told that pop-up to go away. Like, whenever I was... It was only been a few minutes, right? Yeah, like three minutes ago, I told it to go away. It popped up again. That's annoying. Anyway, it's not an ad. It's just the alien respawn thing. Anyways, boy, I sure wish I could sleep like that. Okay. I have 205. I feel like that might be enough for something. Now there's the other one, the other spherical thing I need to get for him too, but I'm gonna deal with that later. Alright, let's see about... Yeah. Hmm. Let's do ink. There we go. Yay! And you know what? It's faster to get... Instead of going across that water, I can go all the way up to the top and get out up there. Whoop! Oh no. That's right, I can't do anything with that. I'm like, oh hey, there's something over there! Oh wait, yeah, I can't get that. No, thanks, scroll. I'm not in the mood. <laughs> oh, no fighting for me right now, please. No, thank you. Whoa. And, um, I think... Bardock said... Yeah, he's like, got enough money to go get the Golden Fury! So I gotta go get that, too. Which is totally fine. Gotta go this way. But yeah, so now he pretty much knows all of the storyline up to this point. I'm gonna try a little bit better and not show them the footage, but it's just so fun showing them ahead of time. Like, look at my adventures, and I love showing him videos after I've recorded them, and I get his response and his reactions to everything. So... I don't know if he's open at night. I mean, I can make it daytime if that's the case. It's not that serious. I just wish that I could do the opposite and make it night when I need to. Don't usually get stuck there either. <laughs> well, he's open. So you come again, my little lupine friend? Have you <laughs> have you come to sharpen your skills? Yay! So you once again choose to try your hand at the fighting arts? I suppose I have no choice. I'll do it as you wish and allow you to ruin my dojo. But I must warn you, I won't hold back this time. Ah! Oh! <laughs> this is funny. I just feel I just realized that his outfit, like his top, it's like looks kinda like my Minecraft outfit, except mine is black with flames, not white with flames. I don't know why I'm just now realizing that, but okay. Let the lesson begin! We're gonna practice the golden fury god technique! Take these tips to heart and remember them as we train! Golden Fury got technique tips. During battle, press F to insult the enemy. <laughs> Doing so will cause your foe to drop a demon bang. Oh, did you understand? Do you understand the explanation? Yes. I grant you this technique scroll. Check it when you forget what it means to be a warrior. You have obtained a technique scroll. This technique can only be mastered by the best. It is not something to be learned. You must have the innate ability. Train until your muscles ache, and train some more! <laughs> this is Golden Fury. This is how you insult them. And you're supposed to do this to your muscles ache. Like, what the heck? <laughs> well, what if I pee on him? Oh, I'm lagging again? I don't want to lag again. I was trying to see if I could pee on him. He's repeating himself, that's why I'm not reading it. 
But anyway. <laughs> I guess I'm done. I don't know. I don't know if he's expecting me to keep going. Oh, okay. Good. Same stuff as you leave. <clears throat> but yeah, now I don't have to do all that extra on the demon things. All I have to do is just give him a little golden fury and I'll get the demon things I need out that way. Alright. Now I gotta oh, get to Kamiki Village. Down, please. Let me get down, please. Oh my gosh. What am I stuck on? There we go. <laughs> Camera wasn't in too nice either. Oh, that's right, it's nighttime. It's very quiet. Well, I didn't mean to splash into the water. Can I get out of it now? Well, I didn't mean to get in the water, period, not just to splash into it. But anyway. There we go. I hope there wasn't something else up here, like, to dig up, because, um, the night's gone, so, if I remember, I'll check up here again, if I have to. Actually, I've been meaning to check my stray beads, to see how I'm doing. So there's two more stray beads in Kamiki Village. And just this very first place has a stray bead. What is that? What is before Tamiki? It's just your field. I'm missing two. Huh. But yeah, this one place that's... Hmm. I don't know. We'll have to see. The only place that's before is over at, uh, by the tree. I've never seen the top of their house before. <laughs> A full blown orange. Whee! I'm gonna take a look. I, I gotta go up there anyway, but I'm gonna see if it's like cave or something that might have it. So I think it said cave, but I think it looks like it says cave of Nagi. It looks like it said three words on it with the question marks. They're like, the question marks are letter for letter. Yeah, there's the fruit. Excuse me. And she's saying the same thing. If, if it looks like it's the same stuff, I'm not going to read it again. Just, you know, because I don't want to subject you guys to the same content over and over. Golden Peach. And it fills the pouch instantly. Yeah, I'm going to go in here and see if I can't find it. I believe this is where it's supposed to be. Wait, wait. Is it behind the thing? Is it like... I can't get back there. I might have to time lapse this and just not speak. Be right back.
I can sleep like that. I think there's supposed to be one more thing to uh, get for him. But I don't remember where to find that. But there's one more spherical object and then he like gets super excited and he's dancing and stuff. A lot of this stuff is repeats. So That's why I haven't been reading it or telling you about it. I know I was time lapsing a good bit longer than I said it would, but eh. I um, uh, y'all saw how I got those two um demon fangs from one monster. Fishing isn't all about catching fish, you know. Becoming one with nature might just be the best part. What do you say, doggy? Want to fish with me? No, not right now. Huh? 
Going already? Well, come back if you change your mind. I will come back when it's time for me to go fishing with you again. Right now, I think I'm okay. <clears throat> I don't, I'm not hurting for money or anything like that, so... Just trying to make sure I'm thorough, checking the, the edges, and the clips, and all that. My feet. Oh. Goodness. Munch and deer. Midnight snack. Alright, so my plan now is I'm gonna go back to uh, Kusa Village. What did that say? Go back to Kusa Village and um go see if I can find this one. Bunch of deer. I know Kusa Village has like that really heavy, thick evilness on it that's causing me to not be able to use my ink. But there is a way to do it to fix it. I just can't remember what it is. So I gotta head over there and see what the game tells me to do for the most part. get double the demon things. I don't have to chase after items anymore. Which is always a plus. Oh, I saw something. Oh, it's an examine. Okay. I'm trying to pay attention just in case I run across animals I haven't fed yet. And I'm also checking for um, hidden chests. Another, another dog. Watch a dog. <laughs> All right, go sleep, dog. You're supposed to be asleep. Go sleep. <laughs> Okay. Oh, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. It's gonna run toward me. Oh, Mr. Mole Man's out. So, hold up. Before I go talk to him, I need to check the cutter house again. Just to be sure that I'm not oh, doing things the wrong way here. See, it's... Uh, is she still waiting on him? Are you doing... Yeah, she's... Yeah, okay. Alright, so there's something else I still need to do to cause the husband to come back home. So it might take some time to get take, to get that taken care of. <sighs> it's you, doggy, you're back. So I'm stuck down here in the ground all the time. But just knowing you'll come visit makes my heart sore. Well isn't that special? Come on then, let's play. Alright. I'm just gonna do the same strategy as last time, just kinda camp out by one and wait for them to pop up. And maybe bounce between the two, I don't know. It's really hard to tell where he's gonna pop up next. To be honest, I might time lapse this, because I don't know how interesting this is supposed to be to watch. I don't know.
and it's mainly because the scenery stays the same, and all I'm doing is trying to hit this guy. Wood. Oh my gosh, I was so tired of getting hit. But I'm gonna calm down. I do not need to be getting upset. I brought this upon myself. Ooh, you missed that time, buddy. I was close. Let's try this one next. But there's no pattern to it. I just have to guess where he's at. Now it's gonna get faster. As long as I'm hitting them first, it's good. Whoa. Oh, I knew it was going to be that one too. I had a feeling. I just had a feeling like, but that won't. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to go across. Oh, I'm stuck in a hole. One more time. Speedy Gonzalez time. Nah, that's your fault for coming up the same hole. <laughs> Alright, well, I got another base for, uh, that, for what that's worth. Um, let's see. Cutter House. No, I need to go back to the village. Because I'm stuck with Sasa Sanctuary until I find the daughter. I don't know where the daughter's supposed to be, but she's not there because... Oops, oops. No, I was too busy looking over there. Anyway, she's not there because I haven't triggered that event yet, so I gotta get... gotta find out how to trigger the event. I still like how the music just kind of fades as I get further and further from the center of the area. Like, really good attention to detail in this game. Not that. By the gods, I vow to. You won't ever. Hmm? Susanna. He's one tenacious dude. What's he doing here? I bet he's having a nightmare about getting beat up by monsters. He seems rather frantic. It'd be funny if it weren't so sad. That dream again. Is there no escape? I thought by coming to the village. Hey there, Pops! Floundering around in your dreams, too? Must be nice to be able to nap in the middle of the day like that. Greatest warrior ever, my foot! Hmm? Poochie, a little bug. Oh, uh, <coughs> uh, here to disturb my meditation again? Even in my dreams, I'm hard at work devising strategies for defeating that crimson something or other. I came here to pray for victory at Gale Shrine, but lo and behold, that crimson something or other occupies the shrine. Well, with my invincible sword, I keep saying sword, <laughs> with my invincible sword, there's no need to pray, but 
Mankind's fate rests with me. I must be fully prepared. First, I must sit here and come up with a well thought out plan. Hmm, now where was I? Plan? Yeah, right. That's your excuse for sleep. Don't go for all your celestial brushing. <laughs> yeah, I dug it up, but I can't fix it. I hope I remember to fix it whenever um, I get back from fixing the. Look, see, there's another one up here. That's not gonna work, though. Oh, it's this guy. Ah, you're the white wolf I saw back in Kamiki Village. <coughs> and traveling the land to bring the good techniques of Buddha. There seem to be so many places in need of guidance. I can feel it here too, a sinister coldness in the air. You have to be alert at all times, like now behind you. And the problem here is my ink doesn't work. So now I gotta defeat these things without ink. Which is quite annoying. Oh boy, this is rough. Uh oh. I'm vulnerable to damage now. can't escape from this battle. I should have known better to talk to him in the first place. I can't use my ink. Come here. Quit running from me, crazy! Oh, goodness. That was horrible. Humans are not witness to such battles, but I saw it. The fighting went on exactly 86 seconds! I know, it's horrible. Uh oh. I probably shouldn't jump off right there. There we go. Oh my goodness, camera. Okay. Now, Wolfie, I'm a craftsman, and, <clears throat> and I work with bamboo, as you can see. But I can't get any work on right now. <sighs> oh, I shouldn't burden you with my problems, Wolfie. I'm reading it correctly at the moment. Craftsman, Mr. Bamboo. Boy, that must be some pickle you're in, confiding in a... If some pickle... Some big pickle if you're confiding in a wolf. I can read... Hello there, little sprite. Here, here to listen to an old man rum ramble. I always gather bamboo over in Sasha's sanctuary and talk a pass, but I haven't been able to get in there lately. The sparrow clan said they closed the entrance to Sasha's sanctuary. Oh, how I do wish I could craft my bamboo ware. I'm an old man, and it's all I have left. To make matters worse, the festival's just around the corner. I usually sell my work there, but I'm running out of time. Oh, any day in the world, Gramps. Well, what have we got ourselves mixed up in now, Annie? The bamboo in such a sanctuary is perfect for my work. But the sparrow clan closed without a word. I really, I'd really like to make some bamboo wear. Okay, he's repeating himself. house for a minute. 
just to look around. some health. Cut that out! You got a tummy ache eating stuff like that! <laughs> Oof. Uh, also, Gardog pointed out that, like, without the ink, when I'm empty of ink, all my little trail, my grass and leaf trail is all dead. Sad. Wow, that's a major bamboo right there! The Mr. Bamboo must really love his work. Okay, maybe this is all I needed to do. Alright, so I think maybe that's all I need to do, and then I can go talk to um I don't know. I need to keep looking around. But I think this is gonna be it for this episode. Let me make sure there's not somewhere else I can go. I know there is, I just gotta work my way over there. But. Come around this way. Because I have to keep looking over in this direction. And it's about to turn night. Well, anyways, um, if you like what you see and you want more of it, pounce on that like button. And until next time, I'm Kitty. Peace out.